check out FIFA Coin Traders for the only site which is automated coins. Uh, they are fast, cheap, and reliable, so go ahead and check them out. Hello and welcome to a Nation of Expert Gaming videos today. As you can see, we've got Team of the Season Bales uh, going into the left back position. He is in the formation 4 2 3 1, as most Team of the Seasons are this week. Um, and we're going to be doing the BBVA next week, hopefully. Uh, just thinking it's going to be tomorrow actually by this video is going up um, and yeah we've got we've got a few more team of the seasons for uh, BPL to be doing um, and yeah we'll hopefully get them done but also I'll hopefully have them done pre already and um, I can do the BBVA as quick as possible as well so Baines uh, he has had an 80 version as is normal non rare then he had an inform left back at 81 then he has managed to pick up the team of the season with uh, 86 raids so some of his highlight stats, uh, stats 98 crossing 95 free kicks 94 marking 97 shot power 94 tackling 89 interception 95 balance 89 reactions some decent stats there a lot of 80s to be honest his only downfalls are jumping strength vision position sliding tackles volley heading and finishing they're all below 70 but to be honest he's not really that bad um 9.0 I've gave him and he costs about about 195 depending on what happens after um, The team of the seasons go out of packs. He might go shooting up But yeah, so the clips on this is pretty poor. I'm sorry for about that the clips kind of got mundled up whilst I was doing a live stream So I'm um, sorry about that. But anyway, we'll continue with him as uh, with some clips in a minute, but what did I find good about him that gave him a 9.0? Well, he's quite fast. He's only got he's got 85 pace, which is pretty decent for a left back. Um, it's not the fastest, but it's still not the slowest at all. Um, defending really good at 86. Passing 87 is really good. Dribbling's really good as well. I found that to be honest, instead of an actual left back, because he has got high attacking work rate, so he's bound to get up there. He likes to do the overlaps with the right uh, with the left mid or the cam, depending on who you've got on the left hand side of the midfield. Um, and he really does get them crosses in good and well, um, which ha which is really good. So he has um, consistently gave balls over the top and uh, scored some goals, which is really good. Um, I don't have uh, any of the, the, the... He had made a couple of crosses that actually did go on to scoring, but um, unfortunately I really couldn't find them in the clips. I did like one big record and I couldn't find them, so I just picked the clips from the like whatever I could find. And uh, really I couldn't help that. But... Um, I found that he was really good working forwards, and to be honest, as you'll see in here in a minute, um, he just seems to just always get the ball, which is really weird. Um, he's always intercepting the ball and just on the ball constantly. You look over here now, he gets the ball back, and uh, he runs with it, and then he'll get the ball back like in the next clip. But look, you see him making that run up there. He wants to get that cross, and uh, if I passed to him, he would have crossed that in. Negatives about him. His tacking work rate, um, high beam, makes him lose stamina really quickly, which is really bad. And to be honest, his slide tackling is not the best. I'd say overall he's a really uh, good player, but he's definitely not worth 190k. I could think of so many more left backs that could be different. So there you go, there is his player review. Hopefully you did enjoy the video. If you did, remember to leave a like and subscribe for more content. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.